I'm gonna go clean a house today. It's called Backyard Getaway. It's a big house. I only have three hours that I can clean there. So I have to use that time wisely and sparingly because I have to go take care of my elderly lady then. I have to be there at one o'clock at the elderly lady and check out is at 10 o'clock at the Airbnb. So 10 to one is what I got. I wanna show you my outfit. Um, so I just got this top on, I got a black skirt, and then of course I just had my slides. That's my outfit for today. Casual, casualty. And I have my hair down, but I guarantee you it's gonna go up because I'm cleaning. actually did this job and funny thing is it was one of his first jobs and I actually came along to help him way back when we first moved down here like three years ago I'm going to insert the video at the end of this video that you need to go watch of us at this house hoping that this has not always been this way. Look how nasty, absolutely nasty this couch is. I mean, I know what's getting thrown away in this fridge, all the alcohol. There are so much alcohol and I'm gonna throw every single last one of them away. We got two full bags of the these freezer, like these pop things, two full bags. I don't need them. Okay, I think I'm done with this house for the time being. I just need to finish washing up the floors, get rid of everything that's on the table and that's in the, the refrigerator. All that stuff on the table I will show you was what was left here. I threw some stuff away before realizing, you know what, I should probably put everything on the table and go through it. <laughs> so anyway, this is what I was able to grab and then the fridge. So let me show you and then we're gonna finish up and head out because I am a little bit late for my elder lady but I've been in contact with her and she's okay, she's very nice, so. Okay, we got some bread, a little Cheez-Its, big bag of rice that's open, some party stuff. We got a bunch of canned goods of beans, corn, we also have this, potato sticks, I'm not 
not sure. It's almost empty, so I'm gonna throw that away, I think. We got some pancake mix, some pretzels, we got some pasta. All three of these are not open, so I think I might take them. We've got some conditioner that was in the outside shower. We have a bunch of other stuff. We got some old spice that's used. String lights. Alrighty, I am now done at the house. It is two o'clock, and that was supposed to be done by one o'clock. And so I'm hightailing it over to the next elderly lady. I'm actually going through Pinecraft right now because the house was located in Pinecraft, right where all the flooding was, and there's still a bunch of people cleaning out their houses, which is so sad. But anyway. gonna go over to Lawrence's work and drop off my breakfast because I cannot eat everything so that's where I'm headed right now <laughs> just dropped off my leftover food that I could not eat <laughs> and now I am going to have to quickly head to the store I do not have enough of like dirty rags or like cleaning rags so yeah that's the plan he was excited to eat my food I asked him if he wanted my drink too he goes nah I mean I got a hot drink and he doesn't want hot he wants cold so I at least get my pumpkin spice yet <laughs> for myself to enjoy So in the midst of all the moving, somehow our mop got thrown away or misplaced. So I got a new one, and it's the one that I've always been wanting. So I'm super excited because it's the one that is usually sitting at most Airbnbs that they use to clean. So makes me happy. I got myself a mop. Adult purchases. Right, I made it to the place and it is a very 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 fancy place and the owners are very very strict um, so and I didn't bring a bucket along I don't know what I was thinking so I'm gonna use my new mop bucket <laughs> as my cleaning <laughs> because I didn't bring anything else okay but yes very very precise very very precise they're literally going to do a walkthrough with us after it's done. They brought all the cleaners for us to use. Um, we're not allowed to use any of ours, just their cleaners, just their mop, just their everything. So yeah, it's a huge, huge, huge house. I don't know if you can see. And it's right by the beach. So I'll give you a walkthrough after we're finished cleaning it. I'm here with my friend. So 
Let's get to cleaning. Okay, we are almost done cleaning. And then I will give you a room tour slash house tour. I did not feel myself cleaning because let's be honest, I had my earbuds in, I was listening to music as I'm cleaning. And also we have a time crunch, so I don't have time to just put my camera there, walk away, clean, come back, get the camera and keep going. Ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> okay, in case you don't know how to clean a window. Out, I'm burning up. Out, 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 hold on. Okay, in case you don't know how to clean a window, I can show you. I'm barefooted and it's freaking hot out here. But anyway, okay. You go like this. You do a little dancey dance. Ah! Then you go back in. Ah, I'm just so hot. Okay, actually you do this. You lean against here, you grab your little handy dandy cloth, and you clean real fast. Oh, wait, that's good. Okay, ouch. If you want, this is what the backyard looks like. Their pool needs to get cleaned, look at that. It's beautiful though, so pretty. Per the owner's request, the duvets have to be air dried. Pillowcases have to be air dried, so that takes a little bit more time. But yeah, it's pretty cute. All right, for the most part, we are done with this house. The floors are not washed yet, so I will show you the whole house. Starting with the front entrance. It is a massive house. That's kind of the layout of this house. It's a two-story, very bougie. Do you know what is so inspiring? It's when you're driving and you got your worship song on that you really like. Right now, my favorite song is That's Who I Praise by Brandon Lake. Such a good song. Highly recommend checking it out. Um, and that's where I say, like, it's so powerful what you 
read what you listen to what you watch you know make sure that it's of God and for God and nothing else anyway <laughs> go fill my car up with gas because I am just waiting here at the homeless lady. I've been here for an hour now. Her laundry is still not quite done. There's still about half an hour to go and she's one that does not like when you just sit around um, which is fine. Very understandable. Um, sorry for the noise. I was filling my water bottle. Um, but anyway, so I told her I'm gonna go fill my cart with gas because it's at 30 miles, so empty. And then hopefully by that time, her laundry's done. Um, it is quarter to four. I wanna get home, make supper. We have Bible study group tonight. Um, and I need to make a snack for that. So anyway, but yeah, let me go fill my cart with gas. Aww. There's a young family, or it looks like a mom and her young daughter. The daughter looks like she's like four. She went to visit her grandma, I guess. Her grandma's out here smoking. And the little girl was showing her grandma her doll. That's sweet. Anyway, sorry, I get distracted very easily, if you can't tell. <laughs> so the most humiliating thing happened today. Lars and I just both got off from work. We just got home and we realized the lights don't work. It's dark in the house. It's warm in the house. And then it got me thinking at nine, at nine o'clock this morning, I went to go online to check um, Toby's camera and it says that we were offline. Anyway, long story short, apparently Somehow through the whole shkabattle of moving and everything, we didn't pay the electric bill. <laughs> and so that is why there was no power. They, they automatically turned off the electric bill. We didn't even get notified. Like I went back on my emails, nothing. Lawrence went back on his emails, nothing. And then he went on the website and that's when he found that it was offline. So anyway, everything in the fridge or freezer has been thrown away because it was since this morning, it's hot. Poor Toby has been in the house, completely dark, no air. I'm so sorry, Toby. Anyway, so he, Lawrence is figuring that out right now and I'm on Toby duty. <laughs> oh, it's so humiliating, so humiliating. One thing that I do when I have to go to the coffee shop in the early mornings like in the crack of dawn, I'm up early, is I sit in my car and I meditate and I pray. Before I even start, on my, start up my car, I sit and pray. Pray for family and friends. Pray for lives. Pray for the opportunity to be going to work. Just everything. I look around me. And depending how much time I have, right now I have about 12 minutes until I have to technically leave for work. So in that 12 minutes, I'm just going to pray and meditate and just spend time with God. So. Okay, I just got to the coffee shop. I don't know how much I'm going to film in there just because I'm on, I'm on duty. Um, but I'm here until 2.30. So come get some coffee. <laughs> One thing that I do actually quite a lot in the coffee shop is when they're slow, I bring my Bible along or a really good book and I'll read. The other person also is a big reader that I'm with this morning. So if it's slow, we're going to read. I know that that has really helped in my spiritual journey is taking my Bible to work with me. Because as much time as you spend on your phone, you should be spending on your Bible, you know. And that has really, you know, kind of hit me to the core recently. So I spend time on my phone a lot. And so I'm trying to turn every time I go to my phone or feel like I want to go to my phone, pick up my Bible instead. But anyway, cheers to a good day. Okay, I just got done. It is very hot today. 
and Lawrence so sweetly came in, got himself some, some coffee. So it was nice to serve him. And uh, I checked his location. He's actually here at Nathan Benerson Park walking around the pond. And I actually go home right past there. So I'm gonna swing in there and take a little walk with him. So I'm excited. So fun to get some exercise. I really need some. Even though it is so hot